Hello. How's it going, people? YouTube. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to PJ Tour 2K23. And again, this is the PJ Tour. Well, the road to the PJ Tour. We're actually in it, so technically, we don't need to call it that. But I've always called it that. Um, this is the career mode. Now, the last video we shot five under par in round three, which actually puts us. What have we got in the weed? Is that a five shot? Is that a five shot lead? I think it is. I think uh, Gary Woodland is 10 under. So I've been kind of playing it down. The third round I didn't get to yee-haw and, and whoop to do uh, over it. Because I'm, I'm kind of disappointed, I suppose in a way, how the opponent difficulty is normal. And I was kind of expecting it to be a little bit more... Um, I don't know... I was expecting it to be a bit more, uh, more under par from some of the, the players, but it's kind of went like, I don't know. I'm kind of I'm 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 disappointed, but we have played really well, so it's not like, um, it's not really like. A win's a win. Now you could probably say because it's the first, it's the first event. People are not maybe like, um, like super duper, uh, you know, like into the season yet. So I'm gonna if if we end up we do win it, which quite possibly we could. Um, I'm just gonna put it down to, you know, everybody else is a bit cold. We kind of came off with the corn ferry, maybe kind of, I wouldn't say hot, but semi like, decent. Um, and we kind of knuckled down, we kind of got stuff in check, and we've just played really three, but like, really solid rounds of golf. So here we go. Could be, could be the W, I don't know. Proudly presents the season long race for the FedEx Cup. Today's coverage of the Bluff Championship is about to begin. Pleased you could join us for this final round action. I'm Luke Elvey, here alongside Rich Beam, and it's the final round here, Rich. What's our next player up against as they begin it? Should be a lot of nerves. They got the lead, they've been sleeping in it overnight. That is never an easy thing to do. Almost an uncomfortable situation at times, but they are playing well, so they have that confidence going into the final round. But this is going to be a tough afternoon ahead. Big day coming up. Can't wait to see how it unfolds, Rich. This should be an absolute beauty. You've been here a long right, time. So here we go. Today. You have way too much energy for me. Caffeine's just kicking oh, in now. The winds. Oh, the winds are a wee bit tricky. I might pull up by a draw. And let's see what he can do. I mean, again, today. the tempo's been roughly there or thereabouts for the four rounds of golf. So swing lines a little bit funny, but. Um, as long as the tempo's really good, I think we can get away with it. Time for the second shot into the first. So here we go. Quite a tricky. Yeah, there's no way. I mean, I don't. I don't think we can really go for. Although the wind's helping in, in a way. So I'm going to play it out here. Oh, that's a, such a chunky fast. Ugh. Just a bit outside. Into it the may room. actually, we may get away with it. Yeah, but we're actually going to be pretty decent. Getting ready to play their third. As far as pretty decent goes. Now that we got that shot right, it's a little bit, it's a little bit of a duff. Right, what have we got here? Hmm. I kind of want to play this flop, but it's maybe risky, but let's go for it. Let's commit to the shot. Maybe a bit short. Yeah, but it's it's gonna give us it's gonna give us a birdie chance. Twenty feet to the cup. What a great opportunity here for a look at a birdie.
tell you one thing, there's, there's okay, a little bit there. It's maybe just outside the left. Did we hit it? Nope. Big putt for Pai coming up. Looks good off the blade. Pai's okay off the first. That's an opening hole par for this player. Very nice par indeed. Very solid hole play. And following that great effort, they are currently in the lead with Gary Woodland right behind them. Here we have a long par four. It's going to take two great shots to get on. A little fast. Penny, what does that lie look like? He's eyeing this up and he's pleased with what he's seeing. This is sitting nicely. Alright, what we got? It's a good lie. Um, wind's in a face. Lie's not. In fact, the Y range is actually quite, uh, it's kind of chunky. Um, we're just going to have to hit and hope. I feel I want to go with this. This feels right, in a way. Going with the four iron here. Slight slope. Yeah, this oh, that, is that, oh, that could play. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty decent from there. I'm not going to lie. I'm happy with that. They're not a bad shot, that one. Happy. And now intrepid on course reporter, John standing by. Hey, guys, we are checking in with Ricky Fowler as he gets set for his next shot here on the fifth. Big time play, that one, at the right time, too. Out of the rough, into the hole. Thank you very much. Scorecard filled with threes never hurts. Good putt to make this. It breaks at the end. Um, hmm. Okay. Again, I think I'm tentative with the oh 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 oh. I tell you. Well, yeah, it's a bit disappointing. Yeah, it's just about three feet away. Job done. Let's head to the next. And there's no movement on the leaderboard after that hole. Teeing off here at the third hole. Oh, I meant to check the, the leaderboard. Okay, um, so a little bit of a backstop there, which is kind of inviting. Um, 161. One slightly, I'm tempted to go with this with a bit of loft, a bit of insurance. Oh, that's perfect. Come on, we'll get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. I tell you one thing. Oh, really a comfortable shot for them, was it? My heart was in my mouth there a little bit because that camera angle really does give you false sense of security. From this spot. Right, I wouldn't say it's the best start we've had, but we're we're getting the shots. Our chip has been really good. 
Okay, a little bit short. Wonderfully played chip shot, judging it beautifully. Pass are good at this this point. T is yours. Here we are at the fourth hole. Oh mate, I forgot to look at the leaderboard again. I'm actually watching Twitch. I kind of put uh, Twitch on, just taking a, I don't know, it just, oh my goodness. It just calms me down a little bit. <laughs> I always like to have something on in the background. <clears throat> right, what have we got? This is not a bad drive actually. It's tight, but. Again, it's a fast, but hopefully it's going to go off that bank. Yeah, I think that's the first time we've been in the rough or, uh, in this hole. Right, the one's going to bring it over a little bit. Um, rough wise, it's slightly chunky. I'm going to club up again. We do, we do catch a flash, but if that rolls a little, okay. It's uh, it's on the green. I mean, it's not miles away. Right, who's this? Is this Ricky? Has got this thing dialed in here, looking good. Great shot into the seventh, and a chance for birdie. Let's catch up with the current proceedings. Standing over this one, and it's a very long part. Oh, it's quite, quite breaky. It's one foot up as well. I don't think I've hit that hard enough. No. Putting's been a little bit, a little bit kind of nervous. Ooh, we test it. We test it. And she pops. Right, let's, let's see what the actual uh, lead is. So we've, we've started with four pars, which, when you've got a five shot lead, it, it's it's not a bad way to start. So Gary Woodland's went to 11 under, he's one under for, through four. Okay. At the fifth. I mean, we've still got to go and win this. I think we we kind of drove that. I'm going to aim here and let it drift off a little bit. Oh, that's perfect. You hear the sound? It's like a. It makes a sound through the air. This driver, when you hit it well. Uh, we didn't really get uh, luck of the bounce there. The This next shot coming up from the sand. Hmm. Bunker. It looks as if it's slightly downhill. Percentage is actually. Well, it's not. Are we going to be able to reach this? I don't think we are. So I think we go over here. Um, let's see. Yeah, I'm going to go over there. I think we even club up. Very, very fast, but, 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 we get away with it. Playing this one, about 130 yards out. Wind coming right at him. One thirty. it's 19 up though. One three six with that wind. Um... Easily going to be in that slope. I'm going to hit this. Ah, so I can, I can off the stick. Uh, I'm not sure that's what they had in their mind. Ah, I can right off the stick. They're in the bunker. Got a chance to get up and down. Uh, 
right, slide up hill. Maybe hard to hold the green here. I'm tempted to put a little bit of like a loft on it and kind of try and hit it easy, but these splash shots are difficult. Oh, that's almost perfect. Oh, what a shot! Yeah, good bunker shot there. Nothing left for the par. On the green now, but a bit of work left to do here. Let's see if we can make this. And keep the par on the card. So how much is this going to break, though? This is the thing. That's half a chance of being hold this one. Of what? Oh, that's a good way to end. What was a challenging hole? Yeah, in the bunker, off the tee. Great recovery. Our leader is currently enjoying a four-stroke advantage. So we've still got a four-shot lead. Next up is this two-shot hole. Really hoping they play this one aggressively. Right, here we go. Just launch us down the fairway. Uh, it's a little bit tempo. We got away with that one. Time for the second shot here at the sixth. Do, 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 do. Right, what we got? Oh, downhill a little bit, wind off from the right. The pitch looks good, but I think we, mm, I think we actually loft it a little bit, a little bit of nip on it. It's a little bit slow, but maybe a little bit short as well. Again, you know, yeah, I'm kind of misjudging that. Let's head over to the ninth. Here's Ricky Fowler. I'm kind of misjudging that that uh, pitch wow. a little bit. Take that. That's quality. What are we looking at for this part, Henny? This is about 24 feet for him here. Alright, so what we've got, we've got... Um, it's mostly coming from the right. Come. I didn't come as much. Oh, gee, that line was looking good, wasn't it? Maybe the swing line, I think, maybe wasn't coming up to the cup. ideal. Nice little par putt here. Ooh, that just made it. Take that. Maintaining top spot on the leaderboard after that. Yeah, there's still four shots ahead, so... Deep into the front I mean, Gary Woodland's really good to play, like, almost... But like, he's not really played around like, well under par, so... A little bit fast. Tempo's kind of a little bit, like... It's kind of like back and forth at the moment, but... The course is not really set up, like... I would say terribly difficult. Well, it's time to head back down to the fairways, John. What's up, mate? Hey guys, we are checking. Oh, who we got? With Ricky Fowler as he gets. Mr. Fowler, shot it's twenty-two on. under. Not. This looks to be heading to the green. Oh, a nice shot. That'll oh, play. Stop it! What a shot. Second shot here on the seventh. Right, we're uphill again. The pitch shot, we need to be careful. 
It's uphill. Is the 99 going to be enough? Maybe a little bit of de-loft? They do hit it perfect, but we've... No, it's not going to find the fairway. I'm... I'm a, I'm a little bit off. Approach didn't hit the mark. Oh, look at that. The wind just wreaking havoc with that shot. Disappointing. I'm a little bit off with my approach at the moment. A little bit of a tricky lie here. Team, be careful. Oh, that could be good. That was actually not bad from there. And this puck coming up for his par. Go tricky little putt. It's it's got that little bit of break. It's about what's eight feet. Right, here we go. Oh, so just close. misses. Kind of held it out here. there. Hang on, this looks pretty. Uh, it's a bogey. And after that hole, leading Gary Woodland by three strokes. Just a couple to play here on the opening nine. Here's the tee shot at the eighth. Trying to bounce back after that bogey at the last. <sighs> oh, this is tricky, man. This is like. <laughs> Right, wind's coming off this side. We've got one nine It's nineteen foot down. So, oh, this is tricky. This is like the first shot that's that could be quite scary. Well, that's perfect. I could hear it. They've chosen to club down on this one. Scary looking shot. I mean, it's it's uncomfortable, but. I tell you, man, that was that was frightening. That's well played, pin high. What's in front of them, Henny? This is downhill. Can't be too bold. Oh come on, this is a golden opportunity. Uh. Come on, could we get in this? This is a good chance. Well, oh, come on, turn back. Come on, let's go. Woo! We needed that. I mean, we don't need. I'm not going to say we don't need to shoot, like, under, even under par, like, level Probably par could be. Ooh, wood ones went to 12 under. Teeing off here at the ninth hole. Uh, still, it's okay. Still a wee bit kind of nervous off the tee. Understandable when you're going for your, probably your first uh, W. Yep, that'll work. That's fine. And he's down there. 
Yeah, the breeze ruffling their shirt, hitting their back. It's going to be tough to control the distance here. Got four, it's quite a strong wind behind. I feel this would be good. Do hit it perfect. Oh, get up, get up. Oh, that's good. Yep, that'll do it. This player is making a statement with that approach shot. I think this rivalry with Ricky Fowler is really inspiring him to fire at those flags. John, give us an update. What's shaking? Hey guys, we are checking in with Ricky Fowler as he gets set for his next shot here on the 12th. What's he doing? Ooh. Wow, oh, nice. Lodridge. How special was that? Needed it. Needed that in a big way, chipping in for the par. Eight feet to the cup. This for back-to-back -back birdies. Right, here we go. Okay, breaks at the end a little bit more. This looks like it's got oh, the Oh, baby. And the line. she goes. That will work on a roll here with back-to-back -back birdies. Kind of like it. Two in a row. Lovely position for our leader so, here, Rich. Out in front, but four ahead. Well, it's been great watching this player get the best of their rival, but still a long way to go until the end of this tournament. Let's see how it shakes out. Yeah, right, we can probably carry this this bunker a little bit. In fact, we don't really need to because the wind's going to bring it back a little. That's better. That's kind of oh, needs to carry. Oh, oh, it's gonna, mm, it's gonna be bad. No it's gonna have like an uphill. Why? Setting up in some very deep rough. It's not bad actually. It's like seventy-one to eighty-three percent. So it, it's, it's not the worst. Um, hmm. Through the four irons, the most we're going to get. Uh, yeah, we should have enough to carry that water, surely. Opting for the four iron here. Yeah, we actually had this enough. I kind of put it out a little bit more to the left for insurance. Yeah, you hit a beauty, didn't you? Let's head over to the 13th. And here we are with the third shot. How close was that to going down? And back to the play, shall we? Getting ready to play their third. Nineteen. Good day. Uh, it's a good opportunity to get this kind of course, but we need to be careful with the distance. We don't, we don't, we don't want to go too far. We don't want to go too short. Mm. This would be a great power putt if you can it's make kinda... it. kind of good stuff today, especially the short game has been really sharp today. I don't know if this is going to turn as much as what we think. Better than most. Yep, that's good. Well, that's oh, jeez. Cut. And after that, they're currently in the lead, with Gary Woodland trailing in second. So he's still four behind as we go into the back nine now. 
Eight holes to go. It's getting interesting now. Right, one five eight. Looks to have opted for the eight. Well, I've had it perfect. I think that's going to be short a little bit. It's not. Bad. Playing within their comfort zone there. Already made a few birdies today, and this is another good look. It's interesting, slightly downhill, quite a bit of break on it. Oh, it's close, it's close, it's close. Twelve feet to the cup coming up. It takes run by quite a bit. This ain't easy. Oh, solid putt. Absolutely solid. Our leader is up by four shots now. Solid. Okay, we're still four shots ahead. He has two under par today. We are only one under, but... I, I want to keep positive. I just want to keep like, drilling shots here. Oh, perfect. The sound. You could just hear the, the air. It whizzes a little bit. Oh, well played. Second shot here on the 12th. I'm tempted to just go for the, the pin here because it's, you know, we're only going to be chipping, flopping, whatever. I want to stay away from that water, so... That's a better hit. Might even just trickle to the front of the green there. And here we are with the third shot. Okay. Again, oh, it's, it, this could actually be quite good because it's like a decent distance percentage and all that. I think we can hit this pretty full. Ooh, it's going to run a little bit. I mean, just coming from the rough, it probably wasn't going to bite as much. Eh. Okay, it's not the end not of the world. For a here. That's for a birdie, though. Oh, again, you know the break. It was a little bit heavy with that. Right on four feet. Should make this one. This is what they have left for a par. Get the par. There it is. I mean, pars, it, it's been quite a, I wouldn't say a boring round, but there's not a lot happening, but we're keeping, we just don't want to make mistakes. Now, pars are good. So we're still four shots up. 
Really second place, eight under, seven under, they're not gonna really do anything. Let's see what happens here at the thirteenth. I do hear cheers. Do we go aggressive? Can we I think we could hit this and not famous last words here. That swing so pure. That's another perfect Scots. We shouldn't run into the off the fairway. We should be okay. And that's going to give us like almost position A. And taking aim from around 100 yards here. Went straight down. Oh, I don't know the, the pitch. I feel I want to hit this with a pitch shot, but I kind of played these shots and I was playing really well with like the first second round, but. Do that a little bit of a fast. Now that could be good. Oh, that's. Yep. Trust your instincts. Four against the wind to stick that one. Let's head out to the 16th oh. hole. A few it's shots still the Ricky Boy then. Currently in sixth place. Chips in. Let's to so play, he's yeah? like. Two, three under or something, four under now, maybe. Always well, nice to have a birdie putt. Oh, this is just, yep, easy. Nice stroke. There we go, and off the dribble. And with it, an increase of his lead. So, are we going to go to five? To yeah. <sighs> it's too early to say Always we've got this in the bag, but. Let's see what happens here. The wheels would really have to start coming off big time. Oh, there's another one. That's the last, what, three, four tee shots have been perfect. Handy effort, that one. Taking aim from around 190 yards here. They need to flight this one down into the wind. Yeah, this is this is actually quite tricky. Um, to at least, well, I don't think that's going to be enough. Let's just go for it. At the same time, I don't think it's going to be enough, but I, I think the, the, the five wood's going to be too much. Yeah, that would have been too far off. It would have been short a little bit. Not a bad approach, that one up onto the green. A couple of putts from there, and that'll be a pretty good hole. Mate, it's uphill. Way away from the hole if they want to make the birdie, though. Not like break wise, it's. It's kind of got about like a triple breaker. Mm, did we hit it? Oh, what a putt! Get in the hole! Well, let's have another look at that one. What an amazing that was clutch. Way out. That was absolutely clutch. That's going to put us to 18 under. Perfect weight again. It just it just dropped in nice. Give us a small update. Hey guys, we are checking in with Chip in, probably as he gets set for his next shot here on the Ooh. 17th. Just swept out. Our leader is up by a whopping six shots. Now. Six shots. Surely, surely we've got this. Well, that's perfect. That's a quite a risky shot because if we played that with a bit of a fast, it that could have been quite is troublesome. That in mind? Wind is absolutely I actually went too long. The golf course. Well, we just need to plop. I mean, term plop is maybe quite a funny word, but we really just need to plop this on the. Uh... 
Mm. Could have aimed over a little bit. Just 10 feet to the cup here. Now this one, this is important. This for par. Come on, it, it's not got much in it. Oh, that was such a good stroke. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, Our putting's been really good, like inside, like that, that kind of 10 foot range, we've actually been pretty solid. So, yeah, we are still six shots in the lead. Three holes remaining, folks. Hang on to your hats. This is going to be a wild and woolly finish. Yeah, there's another pair. That's, I mean, really, the, the last, as I say, the last few holes there, we've just hit perfect. Just what you want. They're thinking of going for this one, guys. You better believe it. Tell you, oh, right. I think this club, I mean, maybe play, we're going to play for the wind. We're going to play for maybe for that slope as well. Oh, I think I came off slope. It's not, it's not a bad slope, but it's not going to be where, where we want it to be. Getting ready to play ah, it's not bad though, to be honest, where we are. Get it out. I'm not really worried about holding the pin. Well, that That'll do nicely. Fantastic. What a shot from the leader. What are we looking at for this putt, Henny? He's got to be careful this doesn't get away from him here. This is downhill. I'll tell you one thing. For an 18-foot putt, it's, it's very downhill. This could be... This could be interesting. Interesting break at the start as well. It's going to breathe on it. Ooh. That wasn't bad. This one is for his par. Ooh, that looks like a pure stroke. Then she goes. Let's take another look at Tiger from earlier. Lining up for his third now. But right, he's uh, what is he? Nice, nine under. So with another hole behind us, let's take a look at the leaderboard. I don't think now there's anybody really close to it. Yeah, eight under. I know who I like. Been the last. Next up is this par four hole. Right. Standing <laughs> par four and leading. What's the strategy? What's going on through their mind? Attack it or lay back? It's tempting. I'm not going to lie. I mean, we've got a six shot lead. Balls to the wall. Let's go for it. Oh, that was chunky. That we are going to get away with it. But that was seriously chunky. That's the sound. I'm... I thought I said this before, but this sounds horrible. But it's one of those percentage Second shots. Shot well, hole. maybe not. I might take that back. I, oh my goodness. I think we need to bounce it here and just hope it like, semi pops onto the, the, the green. Kind of. Well, that's too much. That is way too much. It was downhill. Oh, you absolute diddy. See if we can make this big putt for birdie. A tough one. I really don't know what it does. Swing line isn't the greatest, but it's heading. Oh, good putt. 
good good pace. Oh, you like me and thought that had a chance. Currently in first position. Right, last hole. We've got a five shot lead. Gary Woodwin's birdied that hole there. So up the last hole we've got a, a five shot lead. Surely the, the, the win is there. It's got to be. Hmm. Kind of odd so, but it's going to work. It's going to hold it against the win. <coughs> Excuse me. It's going to hold it against the win, which is good. Keep focused on that flag while playing to this elevated green. Right, this is going to be a tricky one because the slope and the wind's going together. Um, hmm. Have we got an uphill? No, nah, it's... Oh, I think that's so, yeah. Again, my finger kind of came off the... Put the indicator on and it's taking a right turn. The control stick, so... That wasn't their best approach, Beamer. Yeah, wind took that one offline in a hurry. The hole out from off this green here, you'll win the tournament. Mate, I could, I could probably head back down to the tee. One needs to go. Oh, just another, another two or three yards in that would probably would have been perfect. Well, the equation's pretty simple. If you chip this in, you'll win the event. Oh, I thought that one was going in. Yeah. And this putt is for a final score of seven. Well, it's for a bogey. Oh, come on. That's frustrating. Did that really... This is why they put in hours and hours of practice. A putt to win it all. Bubba. Ladies and gentlemen, they've Bubba just won their first ever PGA Tour event. But that is it. We do have the victory. It's going through their mind right now. Nothing. They're confused about everything right now. I tell you, you just you win and you're just double bogey at the last. To be have, honest, you really I think, just have no idea. You're shocked. I was going to say that's the first feeling. double bogey we've had for the week. It may actually be. We've had bogeys, but I don't think we've had a a double. Well, Rich, you know just nope, how this player is. An exciting tournament, an exciting finish. Love it. First victory of the <sighs> Congratulations. Well, I still think the first tournament. I think everybody was kind of sleeping a little bit. But we do win the Buff Championship, which is still, ooh, still something. What did we shoot? 16? 3 under today? Oh no, that's. 16 under, yeah, we're up the top there. I'm, I'm too busy looking at Fowler. Uh, so here we only finished 3 under par. We're way ahead. Oof, i tell you one thing. <laughs> um, yeah, we did have a five-shot lead at the last hole. But Gary Woodlin, he must have... Was he 13 under? So he maybe had an eagle. We only actually win by one shot in the end, which is... Okay, that makes a little bit of a different outcome. So obviously the sponsors love us. We have maxed out the clubs and the ball. So we can actually maybe look for a different club uh, sponsor. So there we go. This is the the rivalry. So uh, we've got 61 points versus Ricky Fowler's 15 points. Um... Yeah, pretty uh, convincing win over him. And that should give us a clubhouse pass levels maxed. So I think we get like a, a ball sleeve, I believe. So we get 500 FedEx Cup points. So that should really get us into the Champions Invitational. So there's the... Oh, so we actually get quite a few things. Uh, we get a putter weight. Shaft, we get a wedge transition head, which is pretty good. Plus 10 and transition and shaping timings plus six. That's quite a good one. Uh, we get this red line UV1 pack ball. We do get the 
uh, the driver, the limited L LXS. And then we obviously can complete the, the golf club sponsorship. So we get that. So all in all, quite a good, uh, quite a good week for us. So I'm, I'm going to decline initially because we we'll probably have contracts from all of them because we've just won. So there's Titleist. I'd maybe quite like to sign. Now, if I had to decline it, can I still go in? Mm. Mm. So we've defeated... Ah, so, right, okay, I've got it. See, I, I think at, at the end you've actually got to beat... So that means we can actually take on, like, Bubba Watson. But I'll probably do that in my next video. So you've got to go through the tiers, right, okay. That... I thought it was maybe just a, 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 an option, you had to take one. Okay, that's not bad. So, um, yeah, sponsors, I'm probably going to think about sponsorship. Because uh, we can select, Titleist is actually a, a, a paddle club and ball, so I don't know where we're going to go, but we're definitely going to uh, sign off the, the golf club. Because we've unlocked all the tiers, so objective done. Nike, um, yeah, we're up to tier five. So we're probably still going to stick with the, the the clothing for Nike, although it's not really clothing as such. It's only like shoes and gloves. But anyway, folks, that's the first win. As I say, I'm I'm maybe going to dabble with the settings a little bit. Because I felt they, uh, well, in saying that, we, I mean, we, at the end we only won by a shot, but we were actually a couple of shots ahead, so I don't know. I'll maybe look into that. See how that goes. Um, But we should have, we should have actually a trophy, a, 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 a trophy, a trophy. So there we go, 1-1, one, one. we don't have any of the kind of big ones like these ones. Uh, I think the Bluff Championship's just like a made up one. But still a win, and I'm really quite happy that we did win. Um, kind of easy in a way, but we kind of mucked up that last hole. Uh, but that should put us, as you can see there, top of the FedEx Cup. But anyway, hope you enjoyed that. And I'll see you for more videos coming up soon. Take care. Catch you next time. Bye.